To create a vocabulary list using Google Read and Write, let's begin by opening our Google Read and Write Chrome extension. We're going to be using the icon that is third from the right. When you hover over it, it says vocabulary. So in your document, you want to highlight some words that you might want to create your vocabulary list from. It doesn't matter what color you choose because a vocabulary list collects all the words in the order that it finds them in the document. When you're ready, click on the vocabulary button and a new document will be created. It might take a moment or two. The more words you have, the longer it will take for the document to be created. However, it will open up in a new Google Doc where you will see things like the word that you chose, you'll see meanings and definitions, you'll see symbols and pictures, and a section for notes. When you take a look at the meaning chart though, you'll see that it includes all of the definitions that are available to Google Read and Write. You might not want all of those, so go ahead and delete anything that you're not going to use. That way, your vocabulary list will be very personalized. When you're finished, make sure you change the title to something that you'll remember and be able to find at a later date. And that's all you need to do to create a vocabulary list in Google Read and Write.